Hey, how's it going? And today I wanted to show you how to make a ordered and unordered list of values in an array. I know that doesn't sound that much fun, but you could use this if you wanted to create a list of objects in apparent random order and things like that. Now this is just a verse device and this is all in the code. And I have two values here, one's called min and max value that we can set here in the editor. And this is just picking a value for the random number generator that sets the length of our array. So our array can either be from 10 to 30 items in our array. It'll be some random value between 10 and 30. So if we go into the code, it's not really that complicated. Here is our two variables that we set. Up here, we define a variable called array length. It's an integer and we get a random int between 10 and 30. But like I said, these values can be changed. And there's something really interesting here Essentially what this line of code is doing, and I didn't even know you could do this, is that we're using a for loop to populate an array. But we're not doing it down here, we're actually just doing it horizontally. And so this output here, this kind of output value has to be here. So if I delete that, you'll see I'm gonna get an error. So we'll just leave that like that. So this will populate our array. And then here we create another for loop and we'll just, we'll just go over every item in the array here and print out the value. Then we're just gonna take a little break. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take that array and shuffle it and create a new array called unordered. And then we'll cycle through that. That's all there is to this. So let me go ahead and generate that real fast. We hit start. And you'll see how it created the list and then it went to a shuffled list. It doesn't stay on the screen very long. But anyway, I hope you found this of some help. Take care, and I'll talk to you next time.